I've been watching a lot of people's reaction how they are taking the news of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry when they pose for the cover picture. But this reaction, this comments that I will play to you in a second, they were a little bit to me, like they stood out to me, okay? Uh, among all of the reactions that I have watched, this video, this video is, is, is stood out. And the reason for that, I will mention to you in a second, but let's go ahead and watch the video together, then we will talk more about it because this is something you will find amazing. I mean, I, I have never seen something like this kind of reaction ever before. I think they look like man. Right, we'll bring up the photo, bring up the photo figures. again, just bring up the photo. Okay, so what we're gonna do is gonna do- So watch the man, okay, the, the guy, the TV pres presenter, and watch for his comments, the way he will react. It is just, I mean, I found it to be a little bit overreactionary. I, I don't know. I mean, maybe you will judge him differently, but I definitely did not think he was very professional with his presenting the news and how he reacted to the whole situation. But let's take a listen. Highlights to the back here. <laughs> and I think if we push it forward, it really does bring out your Run your eyes. fingers all the way to the end. All the way through here. And mm. you're good to go. Mm. You're good to bring down it's, the monarchy. It's pretty <laughs> shocking. <laughs> I mean, Harry's head looks huge. I can't it really quite get does over have that. a very big head, you guys. That could be a thing. <laughs> but look, we did see a nice little nod to Princess Diana oh. there. Um, Megan is wearing Princess Diana's Cartier watch once again. Not sure. But look, Time Magazine Who's looking at the watch? <laughs> <laughs> Time magazine says that they have been included. Okay, so one thing that I want you to uh, notice here, or if, if you have already noticed, is that this guy, the, the TV news presenter, he is actually talking over the guest they brought in for the commentary. Uh, she was talking about Princess Diana, and then all of a sudden he was interjecting by making mention of how Harry's watch was looking like. Uh, I, I find it to be a little bit too uh, overreacting. And number two is that the guest, if you, you probably did not watch the whole video, but it looks like the guest, she was ignored in the most part. When, whenever she was making some comment about uh, even this, before this, she was talking about Kate Middleton. She was talking about Princess um, Diana. She was talking about the future of Harry and Meghan. Every time she would talk about something, they will just interfere and, and they will just keep talking and talking. Uh, ignoring her completely. So I found that to be a little bit unprofessional. Number three is that bringing down the monarch comment that he said, that, you know, Harry will bring down the monarch and Harry and Meghan. Uh, it is, I think, a little bit, uh, it, it went a little bit too far, I mean, according to me. And obviously we know, and I mentioned this in my video last, yesterday, actually, that whatever ha Meghan and Harry they are doing, you know, especially with the Time magazine uh, posing for picture, after the interview with Oprah Winfrey and after what they have said against the royal British royal family, it is something very jarring, uh, showing the whole world that we are very nice, open uh, to you know uh, communication. We are open and we are willing to embrace the whole world, and we have this open mind, and we do not really care too much what people say. We are very, very uh, you know um, altruistic. We are out there. A according to Time Magazine, in fact, they said the reason why they chose Meghan Markle and Prince Harry is because of that of that altruistic nature they have. That they are help helping people um, and going to different different places with their celebrity um, you know status and whatnot. But the point here is that after what they have said at the, at the Oprah Winfrey interview, really none of this really matter. And, and none of this, what even Time Magazine is saying, would not matter because you cannot hurt one particular you know, uh, group of people, in this case could be the royal family, obviously they are the royal family. And on the other side, you also are very much open to uh, show how nice you are, how beautiful your life has become and how embracing you are, how altruistic you are. Those things are very contradicting, I mean, at least uh, to me. So again, I found this uh, TV interview to be very, very strange, the way they reacted to the whole situation. If you did not watch the TV interview, you can go ahead and do that. But I found it to be very weird. If you're new here, consider subscribing, like this video, leave a comment, let me know what you think about this TV interview. I will see you soon again. Have a wonderful rest of the day.